Elliot, I'm about to show you a math problem. And what I want you to do is I want you to make an estimate on what you think the answer is going to be. So give an accurate guess, but it doesn't need to be exactly what the answer is. So here's the problem, 25 plus 6. What do you think the answer might be? Um, 31. <laughs> How did you get that? Um, because if, if I just... If I added a 5 to it, it would be make 30, and 6 is one more than 5, so I know it would be one more. Elliot, that's really great thinking. I was going to ask you to calculate mentally, so just calculating in your head. Do you stand by your answer? Do you think it's 31? Mm-hmm. Great. I also knew it because I knew 5 plus 6 equals 11, and um, if I'm going to add another 10, and I knew that would be like, and you would be 31. Great thinking, Elliot. Elliot, can you think of a problem where you would use these numbers? Um, I got 25 baseball cards, and then I got six more baseball cards. Now I have 31 baseball cards. <laughs> and is that reasonable? Somebody could have 31 baseball cards, right? Great. Elliot, I'm going to show you another problem, and I want to do the same first step that we did in the last one. I want you to give me an estimate. So looking at this number sentence, 25 plus 17, what do you think the answer is going to be around? I don't need an exact answer. Uh, m maybe um, around 40-something. 40 40-something, 40 great. And how did you figure that out? Because... Um, if I just minus the 5 and the 7, it would make 30. And if I added another 5, if I added the 5, it would be 35. And then I added the 7, I knew, I knew it would go past 40, so I know it would be around 40. Great thinking. What I want you to do now is I want you to calculate this math fact mentally. So let's try and get the exact answer. 42. 42, pretty quick, kiddo. Um, what did you do in solving that problem? Um, I knew um, that if I minus the 5 and the 7, I would add the 30, and I would make 35 if I added the 5. Then I would take away 2 from the 7 to make another 5. Whoa, great. Um, to make 40, then I added the last 2 that I minus from the 7. Great thinking. Why are you working with fives? I noticed in the last problem that you did um, six, or I'm sorry, what was it? Uh, 25 plus five and then one more. Why are you choosing to work with fives? It's a little easier to work with 